Hey guys, welcome back. This is Bernard from the BTN HD, and it's been a while that I did a Windows 10 Insider Preview uh, Top 5 Features. Uh, so today we're doing a top five features of build 14267, which was released, I think, uh, Thursday. Uh, so let's get started. So the number one feature that I noticed was within Cortana. If you click on it, they got this nice little music icon. If you click on it, what's going to happen is it's going to start listening for whatever music you're playing. And it's going to identify it. That's a pretty cool feature. The next one I noticed is within Microsoft Edge, the browser. Now, the, a lot of the features that they pushed out on this build is mostly for Edge. So let's open up Edge. And the first number two on my list is the favorite bars. Now, if you have it enabled, you're able to right click on it. And now you're able to create a new folder on the fly as well as show icons only. Right click again and then show names and icons. So that's pretty cool. Top number three on my list is now you're able to clear your cookies when you exit out of the browser. So within the little three dots right here, uh, you're able to go into settings and then go all the way down to clear browsing data. Click on choose what to clear. And then you have the option to enable always clear this when I close the browser. By default, it's turned off. Just turn it on. And every time you close your browser, it's going to clear out the cache, which is pretty awesome. Next one in the list. Again, top number four is another feature that they added within Microsoft Edge. And if you go to the three little dots and you go to settings and you go all the way to the bottom right here, download settings, always ask me what to do with downloads. That's pretty cool. You're going to get a dialog box prompting you what you want to do with your downloads. By default, it's turned off. Just turn it on. That's pretty cool. And top number five in my list for uh, Windows 10 uh, Insider Preview Build 14267, it's Skype. Uh, they improved a lot of the features within Skype performance-wise. It runs pretty smooth. Uh, I like it a lot. One of the cool things that I noticed on today's build is that when you're establishing a message to someone in your list, right here in the bottom when you compose something, now you're able to attach an image. You're able to send files record a or send a video message uh, send a contact which is pretty awesome and that's it guys those are my top five features that i've noticed so far on windows 10 build 14267 if you've seen anything else or if you're testing this build out leave it at the bottom of the comment section don't forget about hitting that like button because it does support the video and i catch you guys on the next one peace out Check out